Hey what's up guys and welcome to a highly requested video which is going to be about how to get easy clues, medium clues, hard clues and delete clues the most efficient way. But before we get into this video I want to say one thing that is really important. Now I don't want to talk about this all too much but it is essentially how to get 2 elites free per week. How you do this is you complete the quest Rag and Bone Man for the first one and then you get to kill a boss which is called the Skeletal Horror. This has a 100% drop rate on an elite clue and it's one week reset time. The second way of getting a free elite would be to get your aquarium up to the maximum level. I'm not completely sure on how to do this because I have never done it myself, but I think it requires 81 construction and you can get uh, a free weekly elite. Let's start off with how to get the easy clues. The best method for easy clues would be to pickpocket ham members. You need a thieving level of at least 15 for this method to pickpocket the females and 20 for the males. They both give easy clues so don't worry about having to get 20 for the males, 15 is just fine. I would recommend you to use a full set of ham robes for this method as it slightly reduces the chance of you getting caught. For medium clues my favorite method is to kill Dagonoths at a water birth island. They have a decent drop rate of the medium clues and I usually get one within 100 kills but the best part about it is that it's extremely AFK. If you want the maximum efficiency here I'd recommend to bring a cannon along with the magic setup and cleave them down with the chain ability and the dragon's breath. For hard clues I have a very short answer for you guys and that answer is simply hellhounds. I would recommend to use a melee setup here with either a noxious sight as the best one or any halberd of lower tiers, for example a crystal halberd, to cleave them down as quickly as possible. My favorite location to kill this is in the Taverly dungeon and if you do have the dungeoneering level of 55 for the resource dungeon then make use of it. It has a room with even more cluttered up packs of hellhounds which is just great to afk. Alright so at last we are at elite clues and in my eyes there's two ways of farming elite clues and it depends on what you prefer, the combat way or the skilling way. First, let's have a look at the combat method. For this method you will be needing 91 Slayer which is quite a hefty requirement and you will be killing the mutated Jadinko males which has a decent drop rate of the elite clues and are quite fast to kill. They're also quite stacked up so killing them multiple at a time with a magic setup is not too much of a challenge. From farming about 20 elites here on my main account I would say that I got each elite within about 150 kills. So now for the skilling method, which is a lot more relaxing and in my opinion the best way of getting elite clues, which is to pickpocket elves in Priftenas. This has a rather high thieving level requirement of 89 or 85 with an abyssal lurker buff. Having a higher level is highly recommended however due to the mechanics of elf thieving. This is not really a thieving guide so I won't get into that in this video but essentially you just want to pickpocket any quarter elves which all require different thieving levels and the chance of getting an elite clue is the same for all of them. You can also get hard clues sometimes but I decided not to use this method included in the hard clue section because the hellhounds are just way too superior on that. Anyways that is it for this video, I hope you found this helpful and if you did please leave a like and remember to subscribe if you want to stay updated with my video releases. Other than that, thank you guys for watching and see you in my next video.